Okay, hello Sagittarius. How you doing? Welcome to my channel. Welcome new viewers. Welcome. Subscribe. I'd love to have you as a subscriber. Thank you for stopping by checking out my channel. Um, You guys, like, share. Hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. Join if you'd like to be a member of my channel. Okay. What is this? Okay, yes. Check out my description box below, you guys. Feel free to donate to my channel. Okay. Check out that Fits Benefits site as well. Okay, so we're going to get some... This is your story reading, okay? This is your story reading. All right, so we're going to get some cards to drop. I hope you guys can gain some insight on something you are wanting to hear, see... To help you in a situation, to help you move forward, something that maybe uplifts you. Okay. All right. So here we go. Sagittarius's energy. Okay, let me get this card. The flip. How many flip? Oh. Oh, okay. Ooh. Okay. Mm. Wow. Okay, the chariot card. Somebody may be all bent out of shape over you, um, Sag. One of my cards bent. The hermit. Yeah, the hermit. Somebody's all bent out of shape. Sulking to themselves. Okay, we have the hermit. We have the chariot cancer energy. Um, we have the hermit. Um, Aries, Pisces, or Aquarius energy. We have the hangman, Pisces energy right here. We have the three of cups, Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer energy. We have the king of pentacles, Capricorn energy. We have the knight of wands here. Sagittarius energy here. That's you. There you go. You're in your reading. Standing tall in your rear. Whew, okay. Okay, somebody wants to um, successfully charge forward with you, okay? They want success in moving forward with you. In a new beginning. Chariot here. Cancer. This is a Cancer. Um, this person is, you know, isolating themselves trying to you know use wisdom um they may be trying to um get some guidance from the divine as well on how to get a successful new beginning with you off the ground how to charge forward with you successful you know they're trying to use their intuition to help them in that okay they're trying to get some enlightenment all right so they're stagnant right now this person could be financially stagnated okay they're in a financial entanglement as well so that is also what they're trying to get some enlightenment on how to move forward how to maybe fix their finances so they can move forward with you in a rec reconciliation this person wants to reunite with you they want a reconciliation with you a stability this person wants stability they're moving forward they're trying to, yeah, they're trying to get their self together so they can move into a stability situation with you. Capricorn energy. This person may be at a distance from you. Okay, so maybe this person is going to come and want you guys to, yeah, live together because that's what they're working toward. Or... This person may move to your vicinity so they can heal things, so they can reconcile with you. Maybe they feel being at a distance is hindering them from getting this reconciliation off the ground with you. So they feel like if they move near you in your vicinity, they can get this reconciliation off the ground. You guys can move in together, Some something to that um, matter, okay? Um, Sagittarius is energy. All oh, these cards are falling like crazy. This person may be head over heels for you. 
Like I said, been out of shape because they're not with you. Um, the Eight of Pentacles, they want to rebuild stability. So they feel if they move to your um, vicinity, they could rebuild stability with you. They're at a distance. So this person is coming in. They're, they're moving towards you. They may be already, they could already have moved to your vicinity. This person, they could have already moved to where you are and you don't know it yet. This person could be coming to visit if they're not moving to your vicinity. Um, and they could just express to you that they want to move in with you guys to move in together. Stability-wise, rebuild the stability and work on a partnership together. That they want to do this with you. The Nine of Cups is here. This person, you make them feel good. This is why they want you. This is why they want this stability. They love the way you make them feel. That's why this person has always held on to you. You make them feel like, you make them feel um, victorious. You uplift this person in ways that you may not know that you do. Um, Sagittarius' energy. The Five of Cups. Is here. They miss you. This person misses you. They may be um conflicted, um confused. <sighs> uh, King of Wands. You innerly satisfy this person. They hold a lot of passion for you. So the intimacy is great between you and them, at least to this person. The full card, Aries, strong Aries here. So that's why they're coming in wanting another chance with you, Sag. So yeah, this person's moving to... I'm going to say this person's moving to your vicinity. It ain't a visit. It's they, they're moving to your vicinity to rebuild stability with you. To work on a partnership of stability with you. Okay? And this person always held on to you because they love the way you make them feel. Maybe when y'all communicate, you say some good things to this person. They keep them uplifted through hard times, through bad times. Um, the Six of Swords, yeah, they're wanting another chance with you. They want to take a leap, full car. They want to move to better waters with you. Hey, um, Three of Wands, this person may have been waiting for this day for a long time. They may, may, they may have been waiting on you a long time. They see you as their better, their better half, their um fulfillment. You're the one, in other words. They waited for you. They may turn their back on anybody else or everybody else because they know that you're the one. So if ever they have a chance with you or see that they have a chance with you, they will turn their back on whoever they're with just to get that chance with you. Um, The Page of Pentacles is here just to get a new beginning growth with you. If there were anybody else, they will turn their back on that person just to get a... If they see they have a chance with you, they will um turn their back on that person just to get a new beginning and work with you. And this is what they may have done. The moon card. And this is going to be a secret. They're going to keep this a secret close to their heart. They're not going to let you know that. This person holds a lot of emotions for you. Okay? And you may not trust this person. You may see... You may feel like this person intuitively... You may feel like this person hides secrets from you and you may fend them off because you may not trust this person. You may feel like they're they're deceptive, that they're not telling you something. But that's what it is. They, they, they turn their back on somebody for you. Maybe you're going to feel like they still have somebody. So you have your guard up with this person or you already feeling like this, like they have somebody and they're in communication with you and wanting to reconcile with you, but you don't trust that they don't have anybody. So you want to know for sure that this person doesn't have anybody. It's for somebody. Um, the four cups. Yeah, yeah, you're fending them off. They want you to stop fending them off so they could come in with this offer. I see Scorpio Cancer. Okay, they want to come in and offer you a cup because they feel like home with you, stable, comfortable, and secure. Okay, you're the only one they feel safe, secure, and stable with. Okay, and they don't want to lose that. So they're coming in with an offer. 
Um, Sagittarius's energy, please. But you could have some um, air in your chart. Okay, um, the Queen of Pentacles, Taurus energy is here. Okay, they they find you to be very stable, um, secure within yourself, strong, beautiful, beautiful. Um, they see you as very nurturing to them. And this is what has them one in this ability with you. Your nurturing nature. They see you being very creative as well. Um, the hair font here, they even want marriage. This person even thinks about marrying you. They have intentions of marrying you. Taurus is energy. Strong Taurus here. You have some Taurus in your chart. This person could, um, you need to set boundaries though. Set boundaries with this person. Like I say in my other readings with this card, mean what you say, say what you mean to this person. Tell them what you expect of them. Whether it's high expectations or not, you need to let them know what you expect in a relationship from a person. Let them know from the get-go. Um, this person could um, have mental issues as well. Somebody could need mental counseling or they may go through mental counseling or have in the past. Um, Seven of Cups is here. Some of y'all could be married to this person already. Um, Seven of Cups is here. They find no other like you. This person may have had a lot of options, been through a lot of options, but they never found another you. They never found another you. There's, they, there's no other like you. Nothing like you. They may have one character. Um characteristic that maybe have been like you but they couldn't find the whole package okay they're looking for the whole package like you they couldn't find it nine of pentacles virgo energy they find you very independent strong they see you working hard um they see you as very abundant they see you being abundant working success um uh, they see you being successful or working hard in growing your success, growing up to a um, successful position. They see you very as very nurturing, creative. They see you nurturing yourself. Um, this has them holding a lot of passion for you and wanting a passionate new beginning with you. Yeah, their passion has grown for you as they watch you. More and more as they watch you, you know, being independent, not needing anyone, being strong. Okay. Or this person, this could have been them. For some of y'all, they could have wanted to be single. They probably never had no intentions of marrying anyone. But you, it's something different about you. They see themselves wanting to marry you. Their passion has grown for you and they want a passionate new beginning. And this, this may be somebody that always wanted to be single. Um, Sagittarius is in a gym. Okay, the king of swords here. Yeah, maybe you always stood your ground with this person. You never gave up on this person. So that's how their passions grew for you as well. Because you never gave up on them. And maybe they're going to come and speak their truth and express this to you, how they feel and, you know, their thoughts on you, how they feel about you, how they see you. Okay. Libra energy here. All right. So some they're coming in to speak some truth, express some truth. Okay. So um, like, share, hit the notification button to be notified. When I post a video, you guys, um, like, share. Oh, I already said that. Like, share. Viewers, subscribe. Thank you, new viewers. I hope you guys gained some insight uh, on the story read. Um, check out the description box below. Feel free to donate to my channel. I love you guys. Be good.